Hi everybody, Diane here. Remember this book from the tags video several back? I had pulled it to use some of these women images except they were too large. So we're doing it in a large book. Makes sense, right? And the viewer mentioned that too. So smart thinking viewer. Actually, just as a funny note for us, us gals, did you know you could make something if I could find it. This is all uh, things made out of ribbon. Make a bra out of ribbon. <laughs> if you're ever in a pinch, there you go. <laughs> anyway, so I chose these two girls here that happen to be holding mirrors and it made me think of, I have scrapbook paper that has mirrors. So I think we're going the mirror route. I have two repro catalogs here. This obviously is not 20s, but it's got some corset girls and nightgowns if I want more women images. And then it's got uh, some mirrors too. And then this one is from the 20s, 27. It has women fashions too. However, it has mirrors and sets, insets, and compacts. So, yeah, you tell me, what do we want? They're exquisite, too. Oh, that's nice. You can get your name engraved or initial. That's nice. Wow, that's cool. Can you see that bird one down here? Wow. Those are pretty. Okay, well, I don't know. G9, you don't know. How unusual. And are we going to have any kind of phrase or quote or get Romper Room's magic mirror or something? They never said my name that I ever heard on Romper Room. And I don't understand that. Diane was popular at that time. Maybe I just missed it. <laughs> Gee, Diane, you want to get over that? <laughs> um, dresser boxes. That's pretty, too. Boy, the things you couldn't buy. They got bowls, he bowls here to force bulbs. Well, this printing is awfully dark compared or the page, the yellowing. So maybe we'll bypass that for the moment. Okay, that makes sense. A modern essential. Well, let's pick one of these. Which one? I don't know. Diane, would you pick one? Well, what about this over here? This woman. Okay, and I think we definitely want flowers or birds, lacy stuff, something. And here's a question. Do we put something in the glass? I would say what about a background? I have no idea. Well, it can't be anything too busy, right? I don't know that I want paint because I'm looking through a box here. Um, that might be too... I 
you know, unless I really just paint a color, the way I usually do it, be too mottled, too busy. See, like, you can't have something like that. You could have probably something like that. Um, maybe I should get that pad that's just colors. That's an idea, just a minute. Put this one back. It's right below me here. There. With the dust bunny. It does, it sits on the floor, what can I say? Well, uh, <laughs> yeah, closed caption is going to like that word. Okay. All right, let me grab another one. I don't know if we need just a subtle something like popcorn. <laughs> Like nothing in there. A marble effect. Uh, um, that's kind of interesting. It's kind of dreamy. It's an absolute dream. That's not bad either. Diane likes pink. No, I'm too busy. I'm too pale. Mm -hmm. Whoops. That's kind of interesting too. What do you think? You want to go kind of interesting, weird? Maybe too dark. Where was that other one? All right, let's be daring. Ugh. Heavy. Okay. So it would come up to about here. All right. Okay. Well, she's kind of pigeonholing herself into purples, huh? <laughs> oh boy! Oh, that's not terrible. The colors are good. I don't really like the style, though, with those girls. Well, that's better style, kind of large. They end up looking like little fairy girls or something maybe, huh? It's not bad. All right, well. Well, I don't know about this. Yeah, these scissors are starting to press their luck too.
There's lots of birds chirping out there at the moment. And then we had some kind of wacky storms yesterday. It's the first time in my life, which is quite a statement. You know, everyone's seen it rain and have sun at the same time, you know. But it was more like storming with sun, with this wind and it's raining and, and it's sunny. I've never seen that before in my life. So that was kind of strange. No, not kind of. It was strange. All right. I don't know. No locusts yet, but, but that's kind of pretty. Um, you maybe even want it kind of up, not so much at top. Could spatter white. That's there's a couple little spatters. Okay, crew, I'm going to spatter some white. Fussy cut, possibly glue down, but yeah, we need something in the mirrors. We do. We need some kind of, you know, great quote about vanity or something. <laughs> Think about that. I'll be right back. Okay, folks. This is much later in the day after much yard work and much to do. Diane, there's no quote. No, there's not. Every time Diane looks for a quote, she never finds one. They're too wordy, they're too long, they're dumb. I'm sorry, I couldn't find a quote. So I did find flamingos, That's some kind of yard decoration. Another mirror, I think is gonna go back there. The word bliss, I found a word. And then uh, I forgot, this is longer than 12 inches, which is what scrapbook paper is, so we have a border. But I have, this is scrap of paper, and then this is a magazine border. I need to scale up the edge. I didn't do that yet. Um, I'm going to paint and try to match so you don't notice it. There was a second mirror. It's a little different, but do we want that anywhere? And as you can see, it's kind of... That's a little much. I don't think so. I'm not going to throw it away yet. I don't think so. Do we want any spattering down here? I did not do that intentionally. Well, there's nothing going on there. My dog wants someone to come and play with him. Would you go play with him so I could work, please? <laughs> okay, I think a little spattering. I have to paint the edge, glue it down, play with the dog, and then I'll come back. Okay, hang on. Okay, all finished. I don't remember what I said. This is the next day. Is this is magazine? I'm not sure if I said that. Um, I did paint on top. You can kind of tell a little bit there. And then I decided to totally fussy cut the flamingos. That was not easy. <laughs> you know, once you have a little tiny edge you're trying to get rid of, you don't have anything to hold on to. It, I like it a lot better, but it was not easy. And then in between their legs there was white. There's no way I was going to cut that out. It was too narrow. So I painted in between there. And then I did go over their legs again because I had slopped a little paint. It's not perfect. I wish it was a little better. I went over the green here too. But it's a lot better than the white in there because there's really no other white other than the spatters and it had these white lines. I didn't like it. So it's better. Okay, kind of ethereal today, huh? All right, everyone. Thanks very much for watching. I hope you have a good day.